A few days ago, I was enjoying my life happily, but then my neighbor just played this. Hello, Adi. Are Pooja ji? I was already irritated from them, so I had to take a revenge. So I decided to build a device which could jam and hack their Wi-Fi. So let's try this out. Hare Krishna. This is Node MCU ESP8266. It's a very popular Wi-Fi enabled microcontroller. We can run this module directly via 5V USB cable also, but for this video, I'm going to use 3.7V 500MA battery and to charge this battery, I'm going to use this TP4056 module. And for a more professional look, I'm going to use this 0.96 inches long OLED display. So these are all the components required for this video and you can buy all these from the links which I have given in my description box. And for more protection, I'm using this 4007 diode also. Firstly, I have soldered my battery to my charging module. And here's one diagram for your convenience. Then I marked some locations and made some holes using my soldering iron. Now I'm going to program my Node MCU. To program this, I'm going to use Arduino IDE. After this, I've downloaded one file from GitHub. Then I opened the INO file in IDE. From the files tab, go to preferences. Then you have to paste one URL. I have also given the URL in my description. Now go to boards manager and over here we have to install one thing. Just search ESP8266 and install this file. After this, you have to select your board and that is Node MCU 1.0. Now we are all set to upload our code, but before that, let's change our SSID and password. Perfect. Now I've put my code on upload and I've came here to paint my exterior, but unfortunately I had to face my bad luck. Just after painting my front part, I just noticed that my spray was empty now. And due to that, I had to choose red color. And here's the result. I know black color would have been more classy. Before painting the case, I had already put the tape over here to protect its transparency. And finally, our cheap D author plus Evil Twin device is ready now. And before using it, I'm going to charge it using my phone's charger. And now I can easily jam my neighbor's Wi Fi. But that's not the end. I'm going to grab his password also. Firstly, we have to connect to our ESP's Wi Fi. After this, we have to paste this IP address in our browser to do the further operations on our ESP. And from here, we can control our ESP without any display or buttons. But wait, how does it work? Let me explain. Firstly, we have to deauthenticate the target network. Then we will launch the Evil Twin attack. And after that, we will visit our 192.168.4.1 page once again. And then we'll get the password. And this is all that I'm gonna do now. As you can see, it has now created a fake SSID. And now I'm going to connect to it. And after this, I'll get redirected to this fake login portal where I have to enter my password. And if we'll try to enter the fake password, then also it will detect it. 
and as you all can see over here we have finally got our password so it was the same password that i had entered on my fake login portal so i hope you all loved this video and share your opinions in the comments and let me know what you all want to see next and i'll meet you guys in the next video till then subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram till then hare krishna